Dear friends, we are going to talk about .gitignore file today. I have a git repository here which has only one python file. When I run git status, I get a prompt saying that .idea is untracked. Now .idea is a folder that my python pycharm code editor has created. I don't have any intention of checking it in into upstream github repository hence i want to ignore it but every time when i run git status it just shows me this file which is kind of annoying i'm going to ignore this directory using dot git ignore file let's first create dot git ignore file you can say touch dot git ignore or you can directly create dot ignore file by windows explorer option i created dot git ignore file and in this file i'm going to put dot idea directory once i do that and save it again run git status notice that previously it was showing dot idea as untracked directory now here it is not showing dot idea it's showing dot ignore file of course because we added that file as a new file i'm going to add that into my repository because I want to check it in okay sometimes you have a specific file that you want to ignore for example I have a taste.py file which I did it for some local testing again I don't want to check it in into my github repository it will still show up here so I'm going to add that particular file here and once I do that it will no longer show in this list of untracked files let's run this command see it went away you can also have multiple files with the same extension that you want to ignore for example I have let's say a.exe and I have uh, b.exe when you run git status again those two show up you want to ignore both of them you just add a wildcard saying star.exe once you do that run git status and they go away all right your git ignore file can look pretty extensive it can have all these files i picked up this example from google and you can see here there are so many files listed it's a sample dot git ignore file you can also add a command using a hash shine okay so that was a short uh, tutorial on dot git ignore file uh, i hope you guys are having fun learning git git with my tutorials i will see you in a next tutorial